Yeah, I'd be like, if you do that on grass, no, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, is oh. that bad? Yeah. Oh, oh man. Broke his leg, but what about the bike? The bike's trash. <laughs> uh, yeah. I, I, no, because, I mean, we, if it's trash, right. if they tow it, they're going to charge them a, a ton of money. Ton of cash, right? Oh, wow. Yeah, so I, I yeah. He probably could fix it and hit a pole. Oh, yeah. Oh, like one of those little metal poles? Yeah. Oh, was, the snow plow poles? You know where we were uh, behind that one guy? Uh, when we were in the steps? It's a touring bike. Yeah, yeah. and he moved over. Yeah. It's like, Maybe one turn after that, it's a left-hander. Well, actually, yeah, it's kind of this left-hander. So, so from what I could tell, there's no skid marks, nothing. He just went into the dirt, hit that that orange pole, and pulled like all the way down. Uh. And then it like flipped in the air, and there's blood on the fairing. Oh, so it looked like the, maybe he flipped in the air, and the bike landed on it maybe, and flipped over was actually upside down and facing this way. Uh. And he goes over in the dirt this way, about 10 feet from the edge. Oh, he could have gone over. Uh, he got a helicopter now. He's, I talked to the paramedic. He's got uh, broken ribs, a punctured lung, and a broken left femur. And uh, he's not conscious. He's like just out of it. So he's not conscious? Yeah, he's out of it. Did so. they put him out of it? Or? Uh, no, he was. The, I talked really? to the guy who first got there. He said he was just out. Oh, he was just, he was, like, just hey, out of it. So, yeah. Uh, so, what, so, why do you want to get broken ribs? Right. Yeah, so, what happened? Yeah, but the lung. Oh, yeah, yeah. The rib punctured the lung. So, what happened was, from what I could tell, just kind of seeing what happened there, because there were all those tire marks, but. He just went wide and just hit that orange thing. And from, uh, from the, you know, just look at the mechanics, what happened. So he probably hit, the bike went like this, and he probably, like, bike hit him. The bike flipped in the air and landed here, and he flipped and landed here. So going about 60 at that time, too. He hit, yeah. hit a stationary object, even if it's just a thin pole. Yeah, it'll just flip yeah. around. It'll, it'll yeah. just damage. So if it's started flipping, and I don't, my guess is the bike hit him because, they're, you know, at the front of the bike right here, yeah. there's a splatter of blood. Oh, oh gosh. Yeah. So, Wait, but uh, where? Huh? Oh, sure. uh, yeah. Probably like hit here. Because oh. think about it, he hit and he flipped over and the bike when it landed. And he landed and the bike hit him here and then flipped over that way and he went this way. Oh, it's my guess. Ten feet from the edge? Uh, he was, it's for this way. If he was lying here, right. if he would have gone to like where that log is right there, yeah. he'd have been over his eye. Wow. There was some pushes here. He came real close to just going over. I think what happened was he thought, I'm going to go over, so he probably maybe, I don't know what he did, but he the pole. I don't know. We'll never know, but. Pretty gnarly, man. It's like, huh? We weren't going that fast. And uh, at that point, we were behind that guy in the sport tour. So I maybe know maybe he picked up a little speed to get around the sport touring guy. I don't and then he just you know, target fixed. My guess is target fixation. Yeah. So.